Hi everyone, welcome back once again. My name is Dolat Hussain. In the last video, I show you that how you can convert your PNG to JPG file. If you have your file, if you have your image in PNG format, then you can use it, this tool to convert into a JPG format. In this video, I will show you that how you can convert your JPG images into a PNG. If you really want to know about this tool, keep watching this video till the end and you will learn how a lot of things so i will provide the link of this tool in the description so you can easily come to this website and you can use it by yourself so let's start the video so to use this tool all we have to do is simply click on this you will come to this page let me scroll it down and here you will find again two options to upload your images one from dropbox google drive and from your own desktop so i'm going to upload the image from my desktop to convert into a png format so i will simply click on upload and from here i'm going to select the image into a jpg format because i'm going to convert that jpg into a png format so this is the jpg file which i'm going to choose simply click on this jpg file and now it will take a little bit of time as you can see it successfully uploaded now I have to scroll it down I have to confirm that I'm not a robot and this is the verification which we have to do I have to select stairs so I will select stairs and click on verify once it done I have to select this convert to PNG and as you can see the processing is completed now I can easily download the JPG PNG file which I have converted from JPG so I will simply click on download your file and as you can see that I have successfully downloaded the file into my desktop so you can easily extract that image and you can use it for yourself so this is how you can convert your image from JP2 to PNG format so whenever you upload your images into a uh, blog post or social media platform sometimes it's required to be in png format sometimes it's required to be in jpg format in those situations we have to use this tool to convert the file types as per the required file type for uploading so it's a great tool you can use it for converting your file into a different formats so far we have covered a lot of tools if you have any question regarding any one of those tools which we have covered please write down in the comment section i would love to help you in that and with this tool we are finally end with the image editing tools of small seo tool from the next upcoming videos we're going to cover keywords research tools of small seo tools so this is going to be absolutely super so make sure you watch this upcoming videos to learn more about the keyword research to more about seos blog posts how to do the research how to do the optimization everything and all you can able to do with absolutely free you don't need to spend any money so that's all we're going to cover in the letter down of this video to know more watch this video till the end so that's it in this video if you have any question leave them in the comment section i would love to help you in that have a wonderful day